Hello, YouTube Silver Stackers, coin enthusiasts, people just like shiny stuff. Well, yep, I got two more packages in. That'll probably be it for September, unless I have some wicked good sales on eBay. Selling stuff laying around the house. Anyhow, here's just an example. Uh, Provident Metals with their $4.95 shipping for the month of September. Three days from when I ordered it. Westminster Mint. Ten days from when I ordered it. I don't know if they had to coin these or not because I ordered some of their signature silver rounds. Um, looking at them as um, a possibility of uh, stacking that heavy as generic rounds. But... This, these are the two choices I actually have for what I'm going to stack for generic rounds. Someone said, well, just stack the Buffalo Head Indians. And, well, I really don't want to stack the Buffalo Head Indians. I, uh, I had them. Seems like everybody has them. And, you know, I like to be a little different. Nothing wrong with that. I'll just move my whole board over. There we go. Anyhow, um, minimal packaging, you see, uh, this is from Provident, and right now, spot price is still dropping, and uh, I should have been stacking these, but you know, I just needed to get those, what I call better bullion coins. But this is my first look at, at these rounds. Of course, I bought my traditional 5, 5, 10, or 20, right? But these are uh, the OPM rounds. I'm going to pull one out so we don't have to fight with too much. Looking. Let me just switch here. No, I think that'll work better. So. Anyways. Here's the OPM round. Um, very inexpensive. Very durable. <laughs> Kidding. Um, looks okay to me. And uh, I, well, like I said, I, I get tongue-tied when I st start looking at this. This is just for stacking purposes. This actually does have a little milk spot here by my thumb. But this is just the mass amount. This is, I'm not stacking it because it's super pretty uh, or, or valuable other than being silver. Thank God, because I've dropped it twice now. But, yeah. No, I like them. I could see me getting a few. Oh, it's always crazy. It seems lighter than other coins, but it's not. OPM. Okay, so, you see seen those. I have five of those. So that was one choice. And uh, this other coin is roughly the same price, but it takes... Well, it took nine days. You know, and I, I really don't like waiting. I mean, if they're selling stuff online, hey, I, I do it. Uh, you know, I have it in hand. I don't have to wait. It took three days to confirm my instant payment. <laughs> oh, wow. You know, I, and yeah, I, I did pay by uh, credit card, but not really a credit card, it's a debit card. Anyways, this is my first time from Westminster Mint. And hey, they actually put it in a coin tube for me. That's kind of nice. Packed okay, nice sturdy box. This was um, a little extreme on the shipping, though. Let's see if we can get the shipping charge down here. Yeah, freight ten seventy-five. I have to admit, though, it was ten seventy-five for quite a few ounces. It might be just because. Oh, there's some wine if you're into it. I, I personally don't drink. 
Nothing wrong with it. Just I rather collect silver than drink wine, I guess. Anyhow, so this is um, me checking out the other uh, nice, nice little landslide. We're getting ready to sell some stuff on the eBay on the side, and I was gonna take pictures of it. That's cool. They gave me a uh, mint tube. I mean, that's like 65 cents for free, depending on where you go. Ooh, and I got my first one of those too. I've never seen one of those. Well, I'm talking about one of those. I'm talking about the pads here for the coins. That's kind of cool. All right. So, what did I get? Well, I was collecting 90% silver. Decided that. Hey, with the premiums on 90%, on I thought about going back to just bullion like I did in the very beginning. Anyways, this is the Walking Liberty Round. And I'll tell you what, they might take a little longer, but I might end up collecting these. That's uh, pretty cool. Like I said, it's a little bit smaller than an American Silver Eagle. But, geez, all it's got is no date. And no... That's interesting, because on a real Silver Eagle, you flip it like this, and it would be right side up. This is you flip side to side. I guess that's why they can get away with it. Because it's just different. But hey, it looked, you know, and I like American Silver Eagles. But the reason why I got this is one, yes, I do like American Silver Eagles, but um, the 50 cent pieces, or I, I should say the halves, because this is triple nine pure silver. Oh, me and my fingers, I can't open things today. It's been really damp and humid and, you know, the joints hurt. Anyhow, here we go. Here is 50 cent piece. Like I said, I bought these just to try out. Here's the back. And there's the front. See, my fingers aren't working today for anything. But there's the front. So it's exactly like the one ounce piece. Front and back, and that's me being me, that's, that's what I want. And uh, she's out to give up for today. Anyhow. I also bought quarter ounce rounds. Now these are a lot smaller than a quarter, I think. I have to whip out a quarter, so I might not have the right air tights for these, but I bought an ounce of halves. I bought an ounce of quarters. Same thing, front and back. It does say United States of America on it. There's four of them. So that's pretty cool. I mean, this is what I'm looking at as far as, uh, you know, I might stack these for my generics. These are like 52 cents cheaper in ounce. But uh, as far as fractionals go, uh, that's why I got these. And the, here I got 10 tenths which is another ounce. Same thing, front and back looks just like, just like this, but smaller. Anyhow, what's your opinion? Would you do 90% silver? Or would you do triple nine silver? I, you know, I do like the 90% silver, don't get me wrong, but hey, the premiums are bringing it that this is actually less expensive and it's pure silver. So, anyways, that's my thoughts. 
I am looking at, like I said, doing a video on my quest for 100 OPM rounds. Because they are inexpensive. And I do have still a bunch of stuff around the house I can sell to facilitate uh, getting 100 ounces here. But it won't be like overnight. It would be, oh, at least six months, if not longer. I'll try to do it quicker, but, you know, it depends on what the price of silver will do and all that good stuff. Anyhow, OPM, I, I like the looks of them. I do have one OPM bar, but I don't want the bars, I want the rounds. So if anybody has an OPM round and wants a bar, hey, hit me up on Stackerville. I'll be posting on that a little bit. Yep. Happy, happy, happy. It's just more ounces to the group. Anyways, that's what I got for today, plus a free container hey out of luck because if I'm going to stack 100 ounces of this I'm not putting them in air tights <laughs> hey thanks Westminster Mint I now have a tube to put them in nice all right as always keep on stacking have a nice day